What is going on YouTube land? My name's David. That's my beautiful wife Caitlin over there. And of course the little dachshund Rusty. And we have finally, finally made it. We're on the road full time. Uh, we just left Arizona. Caitlin's happy. Our, this is our maiden voyage. I mean, we're out of here. We just left Arizona. We're in New Mexico right now. We're in a reservation land somewhere. The Hachi. The Hachi. The Hachi. Almost to Yatahe. And we're heading straight to Colorado, uh, Cortez tonight, and then just for one nighter, and then we're heading up to Silverton, and then take you around all that fun stuff. So, whatever you got to do, buckle up your boots, put your seatbelt on, because we're taking you for a ride. So let's go. Hi, everybody. We arrived at our first day, our first campsite, right outside of Mancos. Uh, Colorado, of course. Uh, this was a little bit outside of uh, Cortez. Uh, show you around our little campsite here. It's a few miles down. Uh, what forest road is this? Do you know? Three one six. Three one six Forest Road. And the forest road's right up there, but it's a little narrow, but not too bad. Goes to Madden Peak. Madden Peak, but little Rusty's here. Uh, there's a fire pit, but we're not gonna have a fire tonight. There's a little trail right here. It looks like it goes to a little lookout area. So we're going to go check that out and then we'll see if we find you some cool views. So let's go. Well, as you can see, kind of came to a little clearing. Someone over there is kind of looks like I thought it was like a cliff that went off, but it just kind of gradually goes down and down and down. Rusty's getting tied and all this stuff. It was pretty thick back there. We just kind of trampled through it. So I don't think we're going to hit a cliff for a beautiful scenic like I wanted to, but hey. Tomorrow we have Mesa Verde National Park we're going to show you guys, so stay tuned for that. Hey guys, welcome back to Uprooted Adventures. We're on day two of our Colorado trip right now. We are currently at Mesa Verde National Park. Um, as you can see behind me, it is absolutely gorgeous. It is beautiful. There's a bunch of cliff dwellings we're going to go see. Um, there's a little info board about there and about how the road that they cut in was built by three different families and wasn't completed until 1906 because it's 25 miles to the very back of the park. Uh, so stay tuned. We'll show you some more cool stuff. Verde National Park. We've got a couple more things we hopefully want to see. A lot of stuff is closed down due to COVID, of course, right now. Um, so we hope to show you a bunch of the cool, really cool views and whatnot, but we might not get to see any of the ruins. Like I said, due to COVID, there's a bunch of restrictions. So we'll keep you guys updated though.
made it to Ironton, as you saw from the little river shot I just did here before. It's, um, I guess it's full of iron? <laughs> some, some kind of kind mineral? Of, yeah, there's Mineral Creek is around here. I'm not sure. We don't have any access to any internet, so we're not 100% sure exactly where we're at. But it's somewhere beautiful. <laughs> yeah, it looks it's pretty. Just uh, colorful, and I'm not sure if I want to stick my feet in it. If we do and we die, well, you know why. With this video uploaded, then we didn't die. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to stick my feet in it for sure. It can't be any worse than Sulphur Hot Springs, which I've been in a ton of. I'd so. imagine so, yeah. But we drove all the way through Silverton, and oh my goodness, that place is just, it's a party town. right now. It's Friday right now, too. So, I mean, every campground is full to the brim. People on top of people. UTVs, dirt bikes everywhere. I mean, it looked fun, but there was nowhere to park at all. We All of our, we had like multiple campsites that I had in a list and we tried every single one and you know, they were dispersed. Some of them were actual campground camping. There was nothing. No. It was packed. It's <laughs> yeah. So far, Colorado is a kind of a, uh, what do you want to call it? A dud on easy yeah. dispersed camping. <laughs> a little bit. I mean, I love Colorado. It's It's gorgeous. gorgeous. Yeah, you just need a different rig to be out here and get down these roads and all that stuff. More, yeah, overlanding, that's what I was thinking of the name. What's the name? Overlanding, <laughs> that's one. You know, good overland rig to get back on these roads. Because every road we go down to, it says 4x4 high clearance or not used for trailer. I think I can get down it, but it's like... We don't have yeah. a scout vehicle to scout out ahead of time. It is maybe one of our issues. Yeah. Um, might need to bring that a... XR650L yeah, with me. Yeah, that thing. <laughs> something with me, something to scout out ahead to be nice, but uh, we might beat feet through uh, Colorado here and head up to Wyoming, get some more dispersed camping for us, because it's time. We got lucky with this spot, really. I mean, it's, yeah. it's a gorgeous little spot. We just kind of happened upon it. We just like, let's turn in here. And there's plenty of people around us, but we're in a nice little tight spot here. But uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed the journey so far. Uh, the nice, you know, scenic shots on the way up through Silverton and all that stuff is gorgeous. So if you like this, uh, please hit the like on the thing, subscribe and all that fun stuff and uh, we'll keep showing you along and what it's like to live in that thing up there. Unless he's probably in there crying his little eyes out because he's not allowed over here. I don't want him drinking this water. So uh, I'm going to let Caitlin dip her toes in and see if she dies. <laughs> we'll see. See you guys next time. Bye. Bye. Oh, that's cold. Should I die, everybody? Oh, it feels good, though. <laughs> well, she has died. I'm not going to do it, too. <laughs> Ooh, that's icy though. Oh, I'm really just laying. Just let me lay in you. I need a little bit of the sun <laughs> back out a bit more for that. It's cold, it's ice. Oh, that's what oh. I want. I want these ice dips. Oh. Well, if she dies, I'll be looking for another companion if anybody's <laughs> out there. <laughs> just kidding. Oh, she's probably gonna kill me now, so she's gonna be looking for another companion. <laughs> I'm taking applications. Please email us at uprootedadventures at gmail.com. And if I don't come out tomorrow, she killed me. <laughs> All right, everybody, this is it. We're out. Bye. <laughs>